What might be an example of how an agnostic research can be turned into a patient solution? So right now, um, the patient solution would be in the clinical trial setting to match a patient to a clinical trial that they might benefit the most from. In the future, we hope to be able to take this to the clinic so that when you have an array of approved uh, targeted therapies and you have an individual who, who has to choose one, it would make the most sense for them to pick the therapy that suits their cancer or their mutations in their cancer. So not only can you match a, a um, patient to a therapy that would work for them, you can also use this technology to monitor treatment response. Uh, the technology is able to quantify the amount of tumor DNA circulating in the blood and then you can back calculate how much tumor burden the patient actually has and you can assess whether or not the patient's responding effectively to a therapy or not. And beyond that, once a patient goes into remission, the common um, follow-up is to do CAT scans every three months and then six months or PET scans and MRIs. This technology is also able to monitor recurrences uh, long before radiology could detect it. So it's a very sensitive way to detect a recurrence and then either restart or change therapies.